The gasket is removed from the outer frame where the bend is to be fitted and the prepared bend is then fixed into position. The first mullion is fitted into the frame. Great care is taken to ensure the frame size is correct and the frame members are perfectly straight. The uppermost spokes are then checked for size and the spoke angle is then taken ready for end milling. The gaskets are removed where the spokes are to be positioned and the holes are drilled ready for fitting. The top spokes are now fitted into the frame taking care to ensure neat fitment at both ends. The rest of the spokes are now fitted into position. A mirror is used underneath the frame to ensure neat fitment on the other side as well. As the spokes are fitted into the frame, checks are continually made to ensure the outer frame remains straight. After all the spokes have been fitted, any burrs left over from the end milling are gently removed with a sharp chisel. The outer curved beads are chopped to size, ready to have the mitres cut on. At this stage they are just square cut. The gasket that was previously removed from the curved transom prior to bending is now refitted into the bend.
The rest of the beads are then chopped square, slightly oversized at this stage, ready to be marked for mitres to be cut. The angles of the beads are taken from the Moonraker software cutting list. All bead lengths, however, are marked directly from the frame. Once beaded, the frame is fully cleaned, double checking for any marks or imperfections in the profile. The frame is then flipped over. All the cover tapes are removed and if required, the face drainage caps are fitted. If you would like more information on profile bending or conservatory gable and raked frames, then please call 0845 687 6680 or visit www.gablecraft.com.